Hi Taurus, it's Elle here to do your August 2018 general reading. Um, it's a general reading so it will not resonate with everyone who views the video, but if it does resonate with you, please like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It's much appreciated. Um, also in the comment section, be mindful um, of what you post. Make sure it's of, you know, positivity. Um, if you do see any negative comments, go ahead and report those. We don't need that on our channel. We just come here for clarity and, you know, positive answers. All right. Um, also, make sure you're commenting because it automatically enters you to win a free reading with me. All right. So let's get into it. It looks like there's partnership here, but there's some obstacle. There's some outsider that is becoming an obstacle in some of you, your partnerships. Well, there might be some money coming in also. Um, with this money comes frustration. It's almost as if you don't know what to do with it. Some of you are moving or you're wanting to move. Some of you are trying to change and shift jobs. Uh, it, it looks like it's going to be successful for a few of you. Um, the move and the the shifting of uh, careers or jobs. There's some truth that needs to be told in the midst of um, a relationship. Now it could be any type of relationship, uh, romantic, friendship, whatever. Um, but it looks like Taurus, you're really, really grounded in what you want and what you're you're standing firm and what you believe but there might be some need or an opportunity to compromise here also for some of you the truth is that you you either want out or, the, or someone else wants out of a situation whatever that may be money is okay but it's like it's scattered you got money coming in um, you're making the money but you're also waiting some of you are waiting for payout of whatever type of nature that may be. There's a friendship that's strained. I don't know. But tabs, tabs are being kept in in regards to a friendship. I don't know what that means. Looks like if there is an outside person, either for you, Taurus, or for a partner, if you are partnered, the truth of that is going to come out of this outside issue, person. Some of you might be even dealing with some addiction here, whatever that might be. Some of you travel a lot, whether that's for work or just leisure. Some of you travel here. Some of you rather be at work than home. It looks like it. It's some problems at home. There are some helpful people around you. Um, they can. They're looking in on the situation. They see what's going on. It's up to you to um, either uh, accept their help or. Or reach out or, or talk about what's going on or not. All right, so let's jump into some love messages for Taurus. All right, what are the love messages for Taurus? Four cards spread for Taurus. bottom of the deck we have the tower that might be that truth coming out about maybe an outside individual I don't know something's going on here let's get some messages for career and finance career and finance for Taurus
bottom of the deck, the Three of Cups. All right, so it might be uh, an opportunity to celebrate, to rejoice. It looks like some of you are having, a, you know, some movement in your career and in your finances. Maybe so, uh, that payout that we see is coming in for you guys. Let's get some additional messages by way of the Butterfly Oracle deck. Additional messages for Taurus. Bottom of the deck, motivation. Nice. Motivation. Motivate yourself. Um, of course, there's some things that, uh, you know, may seem impossible and are impossible. Um, so the quote, for if it's possible for us to, if it's possible, then it's for us to do. If it's impossible, it's for our God or whatever God you believe in. Um, so if it's possible for you to do tours, then get motivated to, to move on it. You can't just be so spiritually bound to where you're not being rational, realistic, and practical, you know? If you want a new job, then you apply yourself. You apply to new jobs. You you learn about new career paths and what it takes to, to get there. Uh, you don't just pray to whatever entity for a new job and do nothing. That's an example. I'm not saying that my Taurus people are doing that. It's just an example. Ooh, at the bottom of the deck, Angel Answers. If you have any questions out there, here your angel answers romance. Nice. You have the three of cups. Here, okay. Um, for the love, the bottom of the deck, the tower. Unexpected change, unexpected shifting of the energy. It could be breaking down the the ego, uh, things being revealed so that a, a false foundation can be broken down, shifted, and built up hopefully in the correct manner. Uh, we have the Eight of Swords. Yeah, someone's feeling trapped. The High Priestess. Uh, yeah, that's Taurus there. The High Priest or the Hierophant. Taurus. Prince of Cups in reverse. I don't even read reversals. And there's no reversals in that deck. But it came out reversed. So there is no offering of, of a cup here. The Moon. There are the secrets here. It looks like Taurus wants out of a situation, but doesn't know how to get out of it. This could be a traditional marriage, a traditional relationship, something you've been in for a long time. You're not even being loving. The opportunity to offer love has been taken away. You're not, there's no offer. Um, it's more so maybe because there, there's some inner feelings for Taurus and there's some some secrets somebody might be doing something at night either Taurus is uh, practicing some moon magic or praying or doing some spells or something of that nature there's something working behind the scenes in, in that spiritual realm for Taurus. You could be dealing with the Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Also, um, definitely uh, something working behind the scenes. Something you do at night. Something you do uh, in secret. It's not being revealed here. It looks as if Taurus feels stuck or Taurus is dealing with someone who feels stuck. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Who feels stuck in a situation, a marriage, or traditional relationship? Uh, they see no way out of it. It's like you know they have given up. They just can't see a way out of it. They're not offering anything to you or or the situation that they're in. They might even just be really praying for change without actually having the motivation to institute and uh, act on that change. Um, the tower is here saying that something's going to be shifted and broken down because the universe is just really giving you the opportunity to change and you haven't. So now here comes abrupt change. 
Okay, in career and finance, bottom of the deck, three of cups. We have opportunity to rejoice, celebrate. There might be some reunion. Some of you might go back to an old job or old way of doing things. Ace of cups, nice. The strength card, the death card, the ten of wands. Okay. Some of you might be spiritual workers, psychic, tarot card readers, something of that nature. It's um, as if spirit is, is giving you even higher and more intuition. Uh, downloads like like dreams and premonitions and yeah and something about intuition you may be getting clarity about your situation any situation uh through dreams and 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 um premonitions and heavenly signs Whatever this is, it's completely changing your life here. It's an ending and a new beginning. It's, it's if you're laying down a burden here. This could be like a set we saw in the, in the stones, a complete shift, a complete move away from a career, complete, completely new job, something that brings you fulfillment on an emotional level also. It could be something that you're doing creatively. This takes time. It's not overnight. Some of you have been praying for this this shift, this this um this weight to be lifted. A lot of you are taking on wearing so many hats in regards to career and finance, maybe your job. Some of you have been praying to be able to put an end into this, to the burden. That's good. It looks like something more fulfilling. Blessed by the heavens comes in for you. You have to have strength. Be strong in going through this transition. But there's going to be opportunity to rejoice because it looks like you get what you want here. All right, the bottom of the deck, butterfly oracle card, motivation. All right. Be motivated to make that change, to do whatever it is you want to do. Let's see. Self-employment. Nice. This might be it, you know. Self-employment is highlighted for whatever reason. Sentimental feelings. Mm -hmm. And this is this sentimental feelings with the eight of swords. That very well may be what is keeping you stuck or someone else stuck. Sentimental feelings isn't emotions. It's you know. It's your emotions being stirred by way of obligation or empathy. So, yeah, sentimental feelings are, are, is keeping you tied to a, a specific situation, whether that's in love or. It looks like in career and finance you want out and you're getting out <laughs> you might even be going into employment for yourself if not full-time uh, it could be something you're doing on the side until it gets to a place where it can be full-time okay let's, let's keep it moving the bottom of the deck for the angel answers romance any questions you have out here the angel answers uh, are here it's here for you in the near future within the next few weeks if you believe nice so answers to whatever it is you have out there whatever question you came to the reading with if you believe within the next few weeks in the near future so if you're looking for a timeline then here it is if you believe um, it looks like some of you are really uh, loving romance there's some hiding, hiding of feelings also, hiding of, yeah, you're hiding your feelings. You're grounded in, in where you stand though. You, you're not backing down, you're not compromising, and you're not even giving to 
a situation uh, or, or vice versa someone's not giving to you cancer Pisces Scorpio you could be anybody um, career finance looks really good though um, lots of transition and transformation it looks as if it's something you've been waiting for for a very long time and it's coming in for you uh, some of you are hiding money hiding payouts hiding hiding something with the moon something you do at night uh, I don't know uh, if you feel like this reading resonated with you please like share comment subscribe to the channel it's much appreciated um, all of my information is below if you feel you want to get in contact with me to schedule a personal reading go over to the website um, Make sure you're commenting below because it automatically enters you to win a free reading with me. Um, know that I'm praying for you, Taurus. Pray for me as well. I will see you in the August mid-monthlies. Take care.